explain to the gaffer sort of my methods uh, taking a seven sight measurement. Um, doesn't take too long, as you've seen the other day, but fairly accurate when you compare it to like a DEXA scan. Um, same for all of you. I'll just be just be fair with it. Um, we'll do it regularly across the seas. So lower body composition linked with better um, aerobic fitness and reduced injury risk. So really important. So the ab measurement, sort of the fourth column in from your name, really important. Should be low, really low double figures really. Um, so if you're creeping up into the high teens and into the 20s, it's normally, or I always got taught from, from the guy that taught me, that's to do with dietary sugar. So too many simple carbs in your diet or too much alcohol in your diet. And there's no hiding place from it. Like if I'm on the calipers with you and there's fat there, there's fat there. And if you're lean, you're lean. You can see it on the eye and the calipers don't really lie. That's why I like it. Um, sometimes the thigh measurements can be high just genetically storing fat there. So really, I'm more interested in that ab measurement coming down on people, but to do that, you've got to bring your overall body fat composition down. So don't worry too much about the total sum, but obviously on this seven side, when it does give you an idea if that's starting to drop down, but a little bit old school, maybe but I just like to see the body fat percentage and so does the gaffer. So we want everyone in sort of an eight to 10 range, really. If you're lower, then it's fantastic. You've got to be careful as well, though, that it's not too low as well. So... There's individuals on here that I'll speak to because um, I'm here to help you. So is Scarzi, so is Holly, so is Jack, so is the coaches. So if you wanted to put a little bit of size on to get stronger, we can help you. And also if you wanted to drop down, then we'll help you with that as well and individualise it for you. Um, so yeah, we'll be doing it regularly and we'd like to see some improvements in it over the course of pre-season and there will be. You're all working hard. Chance to look after your diet now whilst we're away. So yeah. on the beach that'll be a daily event more than not um, we've spent a lot of time in the fitness work and um, rehabilitation work making sure that they're all free and good to train so we've been on the grass lots we've had the balls out lots that'll continue up to Saturday of course when we have a, a game against Cove Rangers um, 
and obviously on Saturday evening we have the manager's team dinner at somewhere very nice away from here. So um, again, we're we're very fortunate that we can do all that, but it's about team building, it's about the guys being together, and it's about being prepared for a, what's going to be a huge season in League One with some, with some absolutely huge football clubs fighting for that elite prize of promotion to the Championship.